This is completely unacceptable. That's no half inch cut. Today I am in beautiful Nebraska City, Nebraska. That's right. Maybe you guys have heard of it, maybe you haven't. But this is the um, Arbor Day Farm where I am at the moment. Um, over here behind me is the Lead Lodge, which is actually where we're staying. I'm here for our very own uh, Chad Peterson's son's wedding. So that'll be happening today. But um, flew into Nebraska yesterday and when you get within striking distance of an opportunity sometimes you have to take it so um, I don't know if this is a clue but uh, spent a little time with Ryan and Kelsey yesterday two of my absolute favorite people in the world um, kind of got to go you know play around on the lawn uh, I was there to do the podcast which uh, Ryan will have uh, coming out shortly. I'll, I'll put a link to his podcast uh, as well as more of a video of the day because he was actually, you know, he's a professional. He's good at what he does. So he took advantage of of uh, cameras and camera angles and all kinds of stuff. But anyway, I kind of shot a little bit of a highlight reel I wanted to share with you of us over there and it was it was a really good time. So there's that. Show. We got it. We got a hero shot. Okay, then we're gonna jump it. Hit her, dude. You, oh, you got it. You got it. I still see a couple. There's somebody right there. That's the good stuff. Yeah. Everything looks amazing. And you just kind of fluff it all and stand it back up. And it's like, oh, I could cut that again. Do you rim all your hole on? Yeah, but it's tiny. Oh. I mean, my hole, it's, it's 1,500 square feet. So I actually think this is more like 2,000. Okay. So mine's long it's like uh 65 feet long it looks way bigger on camera that's what they i've heard that in my life <laughs> yeah they're like oh, oh that's disappointing <laughs> it's kind of funny you go you go and you get on a lawn that's on camera all the time and the first thing is like way better on tv <laughs> <Check it out>. <laughs> <laughs> you know yeah, people kind of get used to the look and the, and yeah. the style, and, and if you keep it a certain way for a while, everybody gets used to it. And if you change it, you're really upset. 
like, what are you doing? You're going to ruin it. You know, and that's, that's what's been really interesting is I'm like, you know what? I'm going to cut mine like this this time. I'm going to do it like this. I'm just going to play with it and see what happens and see how the turf responds. Because at the end of the day, I'm not really concerned um, with anything other than the growth of the vigor of the turf, too. I mean, when you're, when you're wanting to showcase something, you know, I don't really think people understand that either. It's like we're not feeding it every single day. We're not doing all that stuff, but you walk it and you get to know it. And then you can make adjustments once you, it's, a, it's just like like knowing your body, you know, like something right. feels weird, the same thing out here. It's like, you know, there's this one spot that's weird and you know you're going to have to pay extra attention to it, but not everybody has the liberty to just right. walk they, out the front door with a coffee and go like, you know what I'm going to do right now? Right. Whatever. Yeah. Meet the neighbors. So, look at that. Yeah. That lady's mowing. She's having a wrestle in that thing. Yeah, look at that nice little patch of grass. Gone. It's been like 20 minutes mowing that thing. Oh, now she's mowing the weeds in the driveway. <laughs> There's a guy over here. When he mows, it's oh. just <laughs> like he's mowing over gravel. You'll hear like, his, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's awesome. It's my favorite. And it's every week. You have a nice setup in here, dude. Look at this. Yeah. Can you believe this thing? Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed that. That was pretty fun. It was good to do. And uh, I would be remiss if I didn't take an opportunity to have anything to do with uh, teaching and being careful with certain things. So, like I said, I am I'm out here at the Arbor Day Farm and they take a lot of care of a lot of ground, 250 acres or so here, I believe. Um, trees of all shapes and sizes. I mean, you guys are familiar with them, but still, um, it's important to pay attention and to um, apply your herbicides correctly. Let me show you. So this is a, a little gravel path here. You can tell that it's been recently treated. Uh, and I can tell that it was done with a boom sprayer. Because somebody came right back over the top of it and drove off. So mind your, uh, Mind your non-selective herbicides. Make sure that you're applying it correctly. Keep it where it's supposed to go. And don't go tracking through your other green spaces. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Check down below to uh, give a, get over to Ryan's channel and, and see everything that he's got going on. And uh, I'll talk to you guys all real soon. See ya.